All right, I thought I would make a video of me uh, watching my own video. Uh, yeah, it's right. been a long time since I posted a video on my own yeah. personal channel. And today is Friday, August 25th, 2006. Yeah. I posted that today uh, you know, earlier. You know, and uh, I figured I would go through the comments and read them. You know, I posted around 3, 3 o'clock, somewhere around 3 3, I don't know, 3 30, I don't know, whatever it is. I posted it. So I thought I'd read comments. And I was like, whoa, wait a minute here. Because I was looking at them earlier, you know, about 10 minutes ago. I was like, are you freaking kidding me? Not everybody, just a couple people. They need to, they need to uh, like, watch our videos. And, and that proves the fact right there that there's a problem with YouTube and not everybody's getting their videos. So people that are saying these things have obviously not get the video. They didn't get the video about explaining the whole clown thing and the stalker thing. Because if they saw those videos, they would know what's going on. They know the whole deal. And so that's the problem right there. Like right now, it says... People are think, oh, you know, this is only a few. The rest of the, the rest of you guys are amazing, full of positive and, and support, and I love it. I love positive, positive people, and it's nice meeting you guys. It's like meeting fans is like the most amazing things, you know. So here it is. Say like somebody says, like, dang, I thought all you care about is, is uh, your views or whatever. It's really messed up. It sounds like a hypocritical, snotty thing, whatever it is, because everyone, they, uh, what the frick? And and money to spoil kids, like really. You know, how the, how the freak do you, like, equate, like, what does money have to do with the freaking videos? You know, like, wake up, people. You know, it's like, yeah, you know, you, you know, you can monetize videos, but unless you're, like, a big channel and you have, like, family-friendly content and it's all about, like, kids and toys and stuff like that, you're going to get good sponsor deals and, and, and you're going to get good revenue, right? Maybe enough to pay the electric, I don't know, but... What, for a couple of dollars a day? Freaking, you're going you're gonna to spoil your kids on a couple of dollars a day. Be lucky you can take care of paying for one lunch, you know? Maybe it depends. I guess it depends on your situation, but I, I'm not spoiling my kids over. I, it's not even like my stuff. This is like, this is a family hobby. You know what I mean? I got a legitimate job. I got a company. I got things I do. I don't need all this crap. And, and you know what? When it comes to views, views are actually people. They're subscribers. Views are... Subscribers, viewers, people who watch your videos. So you're darn right I'm going to be concerned that if our fans are not watching or getting the video sent to their inbox or notifications because our fans are amazing and we like to connect with them. And it's like it means the world to me when we go places and we run into fans and they like recognize us and then we get to talk and stuff. That is like an amazing experience. I mean, I look forward to that when we're going down walking to the beach and stuff like that it's like that's an excitement and I don't want that to die down and so it concerns me when YouTube is not reaching out to everybody because then I feel like that we're just gonna fade away and then we'll, we're not gonna have nothing to look forward to when it comes to like taking our beach walks and we're not gonna be able to like fans are just gonna like forget we exist and then that's gonna be the biggest heartbreak it's it's not nothing but the freaking views themselves that's you know freaking views means people uh, views don't come out of nowhere, you know, views are somebody, it's a living, breathing person on the other end of the computer that watches our videos, and one day we're go they're going to run into us somewhere, and we're going to be, like, amazed and talk and stuff, you know, and somebody else says, like, you know, who else, I, I, I go on through comments, oh, uh, it's all about views, it's all about, you're not getting the views because you fake the clown stuff, we already talked about the whole freaking clown thing and the stalker thing, you know, you should know what's real, what's, what's a prank, what's a skit, what have you, but based on the videos, I put them out there. I'm not like hiding anything. You know, it's out there. We've had some issues in the real world and people don't understand, like we have our personal lives. We have our privacy. We, we're entitled to our own lives. And there's a difference between the YouTube lives that we share with you guys, that we want to, to put out there in the world. And there's a difference, you know, between the reality of our own lives when the camera's off and people, get that mixed up. Doesn't mean you're lying to somebody if you make a skit. And when people see the, a thing really happen, then they think it's fake and then they think we're lying. So just assume when you see stuff on YouTube, if it's scary and stuff like that, it could either be real or it could be a skit. No one's lying to anybody. You know what I mean? It's like, just freaking watch it and enjoy it. If you don't like it, don't watch it. But you know, don't call me a liar. I'm not a freaking liar. That's one thing I don't like when people disrespect me and call me a liar. But you know what? Thick skin. But I, I guess the thing is that I, I'm defending you guys, you, all our fans, because you guys are amazing. And it's like when somebody 
tries to say that it's all about the views and not the fans, then it's like, I'm gonna, I want to let them know that they're wrong because our fans mean the world to us. They mean everything. It's like sometimes Brianna gets annoyed because I'm more excited about meeting fans at places than I probably should be. You know what I mean? Maybe she gets annoyed by that. Uh, you know, it's like you, you just want to go to the beach because you're excited about meeting fans, blah, 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 blah. But you know what? It's just that's an exciting thing. And I guess Brianna has a social awkwardness. And sometimes it's hard for her to just meet people and make friends. And I just like to meet people and I like to make friends. And so we run into families that are, you know, fans. We got parents that have kids. And then, like, I make new friends. And then, then I get to talk to new people. And it's like, th sometimes it's, it's just, it's a, it's a segue to, to making friends. And then Caitlin can have friends to play with. And then Brianna's made some friends. And sometimes I'm the icebreaker. And it takes me to break the ice. And then she makes friends through me, through the fans. And it's like the biggest and most amazing thing that, that, that YouTube brings to us. And I can give a crap about views themselves and what am I gonna do a couple of dollars a day because of videos like really most of the stuff's not even family friendly that was getting a lot of views because it's the clown stuff and YouTube don't even monetize that stuff or if they do it's limited ads and all that stuff I'm not even gonna get into all that stuff because it's not it's not even it's a hobby but that's just the way it is guys all of you are amazing I figured I would just kind of just comment on that because sometimes you know I just gotta voice my opinion and voice my thoughts whether you like it or not whether they like it or not but I know those of you are loyal fans and watch our videos because you like to see what's going on in our lives or like to be entertained by maybe a prank or a challenge or a skit. Um, you know, it's just amazing that you're there and take the time. And I just wish that YouTube was able to, to share our videos with you guys and you guys don't miss that stuff because it's kind of like I buy a cell phone and then I use it and then I can't make calls to certain people that I care about in my life. And then it's like, this number don't work, that number don't work. But it's, then it's frustrating It's because like, I care about those people and I want to talk to them, I want to text them, I want to send them a call, you know, a message or whatever. And when I can't do that, it's frustrating. So that's kind of how I'm comparing YouTube. It's like, I want to be able to reach out to all our fans because each and every one of you are amazing and you mean a lot to us. And it's just walking out there, seeing you guys. Like today, I, I ran into so many of you guys, it was amazing. And I, you know, I'm just afraid that that's going to die down. And then we're walking around and nobody says anything to nobody. Nobody says hi to us because like we're just fade away. And that's that's the whole, that's the thing I just don't want to happen. Because that's the most exciting part of YouTube is meeting you guys and just talking to you guys and sharing parts of our lives with you guys and entertaining you guys and YouTube allowing us to do that without all these technical issues. But other than that, I got to go because I'm going to go outside and enjoy what's left of the weather. And it's beautiful out here. And it's hot. It's hot, but it's not as bad as it's been. So, anyway, I figured I'd sign off right here. This is the perfect view right there. I love that view. The palm trees and the sky. The, the sky just, look at the sky turning so pretty. I mean, that is just, I love that view. But anyway, I'm not hating on anybody who's like, you know, if they don't agree with me. I, you know, you got your opinion. I'm not going to hate on anyone. That's just the way it is, you know. He just, I just want to let you know those know, you know how I feel, and so you can understand who I am and why I do what I do, and that's just the way it is. And I'm never gonna let YouTube, you know, a hobby like this, interfere with family time, education, and all that stuff. It's just not gonna happen, and I'm not gonna get all worked up. But I just wanted to kind of voice my opinion because I really, really, you know, care about our viewers, our fans, because they're they're people and. When they watch, there's views, and views come from them, and I can care less about the views. If the view counter didn't work, I can really care less. As long as you guys are watching the videos, that's all that really matters. As long as you're watching them, I don't care. Maybe there shouldn't even be a view counter on videos. Like, just don't worry about view counter. I just, just comment. I think the, the biggest thing is if you comment, I know you exist, and, you, and you're watching. Because then I can, like, you know, it's more personal, and... and Rating it lets me know that someone's actually saw it and it's just not like a mysterious view that came out of space somewhere Which I don't even know if this can be possible, but I just like to know that actual people are watching their videos actual fans. So anyway, gotta go